In this video, I'm gonna show you how to set up your Amazon Fire TV for the first time. So all I've done is plugged in the TV to the wall and I've also put the batteries into the remote you're gonna get with your TV and you're ready to go. So I'm gonna press the power button on the remote and the first question it's going to ask you is selecting your language and we're gonna go with English. Now we're going to go to continue and this is going to bring us to setting up the Fire TV app and we can use the remote or we can scan the QR code. We're just gonna go through this process manually, so let's press enter. Now we're gonna be scanning for our Wi-Fi network. So if you don't know the name, you can check your router or if you have a custom name, you'll be able to find it here to connect to the network. So I'm gonna be selecting my Wi-Fi, and once you do that, you want to input your sign-in information, so your password in here. Now I'm gonna put that in. Now once you've put it in, you just go to next, so we're gonna do that now, and it's going to connect to our Wi-Fi network, and there may be some updates, so just be prepared for that. I have pretty fast internet, 100 down and 25 or 30 up, and it took a couple minutes to download it. Now you can sign in with your Amazon account or create an account if you have one. You can scan the QR code or you can manually input that information. So go ahead and do that now. Me personally, I'm just gonna be signing in manually. So once you've input that information, we can go to the next step. So it's currently registering the Fire TV with your Amazon account and you can always add other accounts as well. So don't be worried about that. Now we're going to continue to this next step and we're gonna save our Wi-Fi password to Amazon, which is gonna be helpful for our Fire TV. It's also going to ask about parental controls, so you can set those up now if you'd like. I'm just not gonna be setting those up. And it's gonna load and bring us to this next page asking us if we'd like to sign up for Amazon Prime if you don't have it on your Amazon account already. Now you can add your streaming services from here. I was going to do it, but my internet started to go out. So this is where you typically find Netflix and Disney Plus and all those other things, but I'll show you how to get it later in this video. So I went to no thanks here. And next, it's just gonna give us this welcome page, giving a little bit of a description as to how to navigate the home menu. Now, all you need to do is select your Amazon account here. You can also add a profile with a different account as well. And this is what the home menu looks like. So if you ever press the home button on your TV or remote, that's how you'll get here. Now, if you look by the settings cogwheel, there's this app looking thing. And this is where you can access all the different games and applications, as well as the app store where you can download and install all these apps. And to use them, press the home button on your remote and you'll be able to use them from there. So hopefully this video was helpful. Like and subscribe and we'll see you in the next one.